What's going on? YouTube Metal Complex here, and today I've got another short little unboxing to do with you guys. Um, you might notice that the box is already open, so there's no reason to get this out. Unless you want to buy one for yourself, in which case there's an Amazon affiliate link down in the description. But that's entirely up to you. Uh, I So this came from uh, Jeff. This is a, um, by a lot of people's standards, um, this would be a grail knife, um, but I had to I, I had to get into it to, to understand exactly what it was that I was looking at um, because this this one in particular I would have felt stupid unboxing it and somebody pointed out um, you guys will kind of understand what I'm getting at here in a second. I, it's also the box is up, upside down to protect um, Jeff's identity, but anyways. So what's in here and the reason that it's important um, is because it might look familiar to a few of you. And some people are gonna look at that and go, I have seen that. Some people are gonna know exactly where this uh, came from. Some people are gonna be, you know, br you know, just busting their minds thinking, what, where have I seen that before? What is that? So this is the um, custom uh, Luma Blades Raven. I believe, let me make sure, yeah, Luma USA. And for those of you who know, you know, it's not gonna do me any good, to, do you any good for me to tell you the answer, but for those of you who just can't figure it out, um, where you've seen this before is Jim Skelton's channel. This, ni this knife was actually owned by Jim Skelton. Um, he did a, uh, an overview review type video on this knife um, about two years ago. Um, so uh, it was funny actually, um, uh, Jeff was like, hey, did you, did you get the Skelton knife yet? And uh, I was thinking one of Skelton's actual, one of Jim Skelton's actual fixed blades, his custom fixed blades that he makes. So I opened, opened this up and I was like, what is he talking about? And then I realized he meant it was actually on his channel. So this is really cool. Um, I'm, uh, I'm honored to um, take a look at a knife that um, Jim Skelton actually owned and uh, took a look at on his channel. Um, as you can see, this is uh, quite the big boy. It has an interesting lanyard bead on it. Nice gear pattern, titanium uh, backspacer. Really interesting um, sort of 3D illusion cubic pattern. You know, you can't tell if it stares, you know, sort of, cube stairs going up or going down. Um, it reminds me of that painting. And then really cool, almost, uh, you know what it makes me think of is the, um, and now this came out well before the Hinderer Jurassic, but it kind of makes me think of an oversized Hinderer Jurassic with that beautiful um, sort of, I don't know, it kind of looks like a T-Rex, doesn't it? It kind of does, it looks like a folding Tyrannosaurus Rex. I think I understand exactly where uh, Rick Hinder got that idea there. But um, yeah, this is an awesome piece. Can't wait to talk about it. Um, but uh, in any case, I hope you guys um, are excited. Um, I definitely am. I'm, I'm actually gonna make an attempt to speak with Jim Skelton on Instagram about this, maybe get some uh, details that uh, would be important for you guys. Um, but uh, anyways, that's gonna be pretty much it for this short little unboxing. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like. If you'd like to check out my other content, I do of course have lots of videos of knives uh, that are either expensive or inexpensive that I do not like, so check those out. And if you enjoy all of my content, go ahead and click on this Metal Complex logo right here and subscribe to my channel because there is definitely more coming. Thanks again for watching everybody and have a great day.